Now, the Philippines President Rodrigo Duterte has restored a crucial part governing the presence of uh, U.S. troops in the Philippines. A deal was reached after the two countries' defense ministers met in Manila. The Visiting Forces Agreement provides rules for the rotation of thousands of U.S. troops in and out of the Philippines for war drills and exercises. It has assumed additional importance as the United States and its allies contend with China. The president decided to uh, recall or retract the termination data for the VFA. So uh, the VFA is in full force again. There is no uh, termination data of pending. And uh, we are back on track uh, with the secretary to plan for future exercises under the VFA. Our country faces a range of challenges, from the climate crisis to the pandemic. And as we do, a strong, resilient U.S.-Philippine alliance will remain vital to the security, stability, and prosperity of the Indo-Pacific. At the top of my agenda was finding ways to enhance and reinvigorate our alliance and our mutual defense treaty. These include maritime cooperation, support to further modernize the armed forces of the Philippines, and investments that will help the Philippines navigate the region's complex security environment. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.